All right, today I'm going to be playing the Tomb Raider 1 through 3 Remastered, and of course, still before I begin, happy birthday to me. And of course, I'm going to be playing every single game throughout the whole summer. So this month, June is going to be the first game, July is going to be the second, and August will be the last game. Whether I beat the games or not, we'll see. But anyways, uh, with that out of the way, let's get started. But before I jump into the game, let's take a look at Lara's home. Actually, now that I think about it, uh, if this really is Lara's home, I'll take you on a guided tour. Use the D-pad to go into the music room. It's also a good way to learn, learn the tutorials. I know this is. I know Lara inherited this, but. Dr. Croft? Who paid him? Now press it again and quickly press one of the directions and I'll jump that way. Whee. Oh, and one last thing, I expect a lot of failure. And the controls are definitely going to take some getting used to. Oh, I also forgot to mention that this is the only day for a three hour stream. One of the paintings, the girl with the pearl earring. Yeah, I think using the D-pad is going to be a lot easier than the control stick, so. Which I'm kind of surprised about. I'm surprised I didn't utilize the joystick as well as a. Uh, because. I mean, it pretty much functions all the same, but for whatever reason here... Run up to a crate, and while still pressing forward, press action, and I'll vault up onto it. Yeah, Tibet doesn't tell you which button. Oh, there it goes. Okay, she didn't specify that you have to hold the action button down. So yeah, that's partially her fault. And we can also partially uh, contort uh, Lara's back. Ooh, old and new. I like that.
I probably should have, uh... <laughs> I don't actually run everywhere. When I want to be careful, I walk. Hold down the walk button and walk to the white line. Yeah. She didn't specify what the button is. In fact, you know what? Quite frankly, uh... Oh, walk is X? That's weird. I just want to take a look at too before we get started. Oh, I see. This might be a little easier, so yeah. That's a good thing I'm getting used to these controls now, so I don't have to fart around later. Treasure. Gimme, 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 gimme.
right, this is a really big one. To do a running jump exactly as before, except while I'm in the air, press and hold the action button to make me grab the ledge. What? This is making absolutely no freaking sense. And the action button is Y, and yet she doesn't seem to be uh, responding very well. Hey, yeah, see, I did, I did exactly that, and yet nothing happens. I don't get it. I do not understand. And I was in the air. So this is probably going to be a challenge for me. Hey, see, just for the record. This is your action button right here. For modern controls, that is. Walk to the edge with the white line until I stop. Then let go of walk and tap backwards to give me a run up. Press forward and almost immediately press and hold the jump button. I won't actually jump until the last minute. get this at all. But you know what? I mean, yeah, jumping across the ledge is easy. This is a really big one. To do a running jump exactly as before, except while I'm in the air, press and hold the action button to make me grab the ledge. Oh god, these controls suck. the button while I was in the air and yet nothing happens. That doesn't make any sense. That doesn't quite work like that. Yeah, you see? Yeah, it doesn't quite work like that, I'm afraid. Yeah, you see what Lara said just made absolutely no sense. Try to vault up here. I can't climb up because the gap is too small. But press right and I'll shimmy sideways until there is room. Forward. Tap backwards and I'll jump off backwards. Immediately press and hold the action button and I'll grab the ledge on the way down. What? That doesn't make any sense. You don't do exactly what you uh, say there, Lara. Because this isn't Resident Evil. As you can see, I might have to change the controls back. You see, now that looks much, now that looks better. Except now. God, this is so freaking horrible. Controls are terrible. And I'm not just saying that because I'm so used to a Resident Evil. What I'm saying is... You know what? Wait a second. Give me an idea. I know exactly what to do. Let me take a look at something here. Yeah, everything is still the same. Yeah, it seems like I might have to switch it back to tank controls because tank does a better job. I can get an idea. One sec. 
See, this is the advantage of having the, uh, of having the Ultra, whether you have the S23 or the S24. Just give me one moment here. I got an idea of what to do. Okay, with the exception of those right there. Okay, hang on a second here. We're gonna... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a little mix and matching here. Yeah, that will still stay the same no matter what. I'm going to switch the action to B. Make things a little easier. That looks all fine. Oh, wait a second. Those are, that's click. Yeah, this, this is fine. I mean, this looks good. Problems with Lars jumps is just ex they're extremely floaty. Walk to the edge with the white line until I stop. Then let go of warp and tap backwards to give me a run up. Press forward and almost immediately press and hold the jump button. I won't actually jump until the last minute. Like I said, there's got to be somewhere to mix and match all these controls. So, geez, I'm not utilizing Y at all. I mean, if B wants to be rolled, that's completely fine. I'm fine. I'm fine with that. And like I said, it's, this is just a test of experimentation. I don't feel like I can figure out some way how to. Uh, Make the best of both worlds. You know? I mean, for the most part, everything seems to be running fine. I just keep forgetting it's select that's pause, not start. Change back to default. Oh, right, I don't have a dash button. Actually, now I do.
while you're spending, this, while you're spending a good chunk of the stream just doing the tutorials. Not exactly my cup of tea. some of these like I said this is not Resident Evil well, at, least with the, at least with Resident Evil you're used to the uh, tank controls to the edge with the white line this game however stop. should not have tank controls At some point, I will get used to this, but <laughs> that's going to take some time. These controls suck. Both the tank and modern controls suck. And it's too bad you can't mix and match the best of both worlds, you know? But, as the old saying goes, practice does indeed make perfect. That, 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 that'll work. Okay, that works. I guess that works for now. Like I said, I don't know how people in 1996 were able to get used to these controls, because because I swear they alter on you no matter what. And you really can't mix and match either, which is kind of stupid. Because like I said, Resident Evil, this is not. I really want to get this last, I really want to clear this last gap, then I'll get going. Unless you can walk backwards, at least. And I don't think tanks behave like that, as far as I know. Out of customization here. Walk to action. I wonder what that means.
Oh. Hello. What do we have here? Well, what do we have here? Okay, I can see a little bit of improvement here. Alright, I can see where we're going with this. Not really, Lara, because you see, if that really was nice, you would have done it from there, so. Right, this is a really big one. To do a running jump exactly as before, except while I'm in the air, press and hold the action button to make me grab the ledge. And not belly flap. God, like I said, sometimes these controls are just friggin' horrible. And like I said, I don't know how people in 1996 were able to do this. I do not know. Then again, I'm probably sure using a PlayStation controller. But like I said before, the only issue I'm having so far is the movement. The buttons work. Because if you notice when I press down, Lara stepped back. Normal people don't do that. They walk backwards, not, not leap. Wow. But I mean, I get the gist of it. I mean, I have the idea down. It's just the execution that sucks. Oop, not sound, you silly, silly dink. Um. Okay, you weren't supposed to do that. Uh, what controls do I have set this to again? Is it modern? Tank. Let's try it with modern. How's this fair? Ugh. I never thought I'd say this, but I think the tank controls were a little bit better. So I think we're just gonna stick with tank from now on. Because at least this makes a little more sense. You know, I think I'm going to take a little bit of a practice. That is not required jumping height. go okay okay that works I guess I suppose right this is a really big one to do a running jump exactly as before except while I'm in the air press and hold the action button to make me grab the ledge Oh, there we go. Okay. That looks good. There you go. All right. I think we're getting the gist of it now. There we let's go. go for a swim. Yes, let's go for a swim indeed. Jump and the directions move me around underwater. Just use forward and left and right to maneuver around on the 
surface. Press jump to dive down for another swim about, or go to the edge and press action to climb out. Right, now I'd better take off these wet clothes. Well, like I said, I've got the gist of it. But you know what? Like I said, I'm getting the gist of it here, but boy, this is going to take a lot of getting used to. But anyways, um, I got to check one thing real fast. Then we'll get down to business. <clears throat> mm. Okay, so I think... I just realized something else. I think unfinished business is the <sighs> is the sequel to the. It's just bonus levels is what it is, but whether but when it where it takes place, I don't know. Hotel, Calcutta, present day. Time to head on in.
Okay, that takes care of that. I think I should also mention that, uh, there's gonna be a lot of face planning. That's right, I gotta back into it. You can't uh, go forward. That's right. Okay, Laura, there's a lever right there. You can press it anytime you like. There you go. go. That's how we do it. That's how we take care of business. attention. Where do you go from here? Oh, I hate it when the camera does that. I wonder if there's an option for a...
So like I said before here, this is going to be a very blind playthrough. And I literally do mean a very, very blind playthrough. Let my stupid channel learn to behave itself. So which means I'm not going to have a clue where I'm going. So you're going to have to bear with me on this. <clears throat> Hello? I hear a voice. Or is it just my overactive imagination? No. No, well, someone's there. I heard a voice. Alright, let's do some more, uh, Baldur's Gate oh. before I do that. Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, all that stuff. Oh, that's just me. That was just an old video. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. Anyways, enough, enough tomfoolery, back to business. I really hate this new uh, Twitch layout. No, seriously, I hate this new layout. Twitch really needs to, uh... Twitch needs to go back to the old ways here. Because I hate this new layout. But... Don't worry about that later. I think I have to go back. Because there was another room I missed. This room. Anyways. I think at some point here we are going to have to cross paths there, but I guess actually I was going the right way the first time, and god dang it, I hate these controls. I really, really, really do. And many people are complaining that Resident Evil's controls were, uh, horrible. But at least with take controls on Resident Evil, at least it works. Here, not so. I mean, yeah, I'm well aware this is not Super Mario 64, but... That's not the issue. Uh, the issue is, yeah, the... The issue is that the controls should have been a little more free. Rather than... Oh, you gotta do this to do that. But then again, of course, I've never played the original, so I really can't compare this to the original. As in the original original. There's a secret there. It doesn't seem likely. Wait. There is something down there. Hmm. What could it be? Yeah, this works. There is something there. What do we have here? Huh, there is something here.
He probably doesn't have anything useful anyway, so... Let's just uh, move on. Unless I need something else, but... We'll worry about that later. So which means I gotta retraverse the bridge once again. Which is fine and dandy, I guess. I suppose. And Laura, you don't need to smack your face against the wall here. It's not necessary. Oh, it's through here. Oh. Never mind. I wonder if I can grab the bridge. Uh, that's just wishful thinking, but... Oh yeah, one thing I should say, the one advantage that the original version has over the uh, remaster is that at least the original is a little bit brighter, which means I'll be able to see things a little bit easier. Sorry, Mr. Bear. Get off of me. Start to see where we're going with this. Like I said, I don't think this guy's got much to say anyway, so... Let's just ignore him and let's move on. That first aid kit's gonna come in handy.
let's head downstairs. We're diving deeper into the mystery here. God, like I said, these constructs are horrible. Even with the mix and matching options. Oh, what do we have here? One of the first aid kit. Very nice. I will take that. this room a little more before I go eh, too far into my journeys. See if there's anything else. And there actually is something up there. What? One wants knowledge, one must seek it. So is it just me or is there like a little bit of light around Laura in the standard? But in the oh. but it looks like in the remaster there is no uh light. Or it could be just my, be my overactive imagination. was close. There we go. Boy, this game's got a bit of a learning curve. But hopefully in the end it all pays off. See ya. Oh, we're on the other side of that, uh... Oh, we're back at the other side from the beginning. <sighs> hmm. 
excuse me. Yeah. Yeah, I think they screwed yeah, they screwed up Lara's roll. Because when you roll either you roll forward or you roll back or not roll and then turn around. That like that's not how the physics work in real life. Unless you're extremely nimble. Anywho. Anyway, that's not of importance right now. What is important is that we gotta figure out exactly where to go next. Jesus. But luckily the darts move slow enough, so at least I'll be able to dodge them easily. going. So I found one secret, so that's 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 okay. So now we're moving on to the next section here. I mean, not a bad not not a bad start. I mean, I could have, could I have done better? Yes, but you know what? Well, let's just call this good for now. This game's even worse than the controls. God. I gotta save these for, like, emergencies. I can't, uh, waste them.
I think that'd be a good time to use a uh, one of these. Okay, so we are going to have to go underwater at some point. But for right now, we got to explore and start looking for items. You can't offer me a little... She's shooting at the screen. I think I've pretty much explored every option I can think of here. So which means now we gotta start diving. At least the one thing that this game got right was swimming. Swimming's pretty easy. I'm not worried about it. See, swimming is really easy. That's one thing I like about this game. See that? Very easy swimming controls. Take a closer 
Let's look at the snakes. It's the movement in combat I don't like. Shoot the snakes. Can I shoot the snakes? Nope. And the other thing that bothers me is what kind of what kind of firearm does does Lara carry anyways? I mean, you can't have that much ammo in a magazine. <clears throat> but anyways, now that I found the room of snakes. Let's get out of here. Get this way. Okay, this takes me back to where I was before. out of oxygen. I think I'm gonna have to head back. Botch this and try it again. I don't want to drown. I was just in. Yeah, that's just a pen. here. An underwater switch. Oh no, somebody's in the room with the snakes. Oh jeez. Now if that's the case, I would be really, 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 really pissed. Or just straight up here. Uh oh. This does not look good for our heroine. Oh, this isn't one of the other games where she like it like a scuba gear or something. And she's pretty much dead. She's pretty much dead, Jim. Rest in peace, Lara. Yep. Rest in peace. Oh well. She's not a she's not Aqua Woman, that's for sure. Well, let's take it to start from here, so... Now I know what to do! Like I said, the combat was the first thing that Aspire should have fixed. Saber too. They should have taken care of the controls first before releasing this. 
Like I said, combat is really awkward. Bad dog. Wait, what's that? Oh, is that a switch? And of course it is. As I think it is. looks like a tanning rack of some kind for snake for pelts Looks like we got a we got our first puzzle of the game. If only the camera would just Jesus. Like I said, this is not a horrible game, but boy, boy, they should have just really spent more time uh, uh, finding it. Then this game would have been a, then this remake would have been awesome. Spare, so yeah, the controls should have been the first thing they should have worked on.
That should do it. A whole bunch of pots. Oh, I can't break the pots. That sucks. Stay down. More of like these are terracotta pots. Oh, what's this? What do we have here? Hello, a key. In one way, I'm actually kind of glad I died, you know? Oh, what do we have here? at some point. Hmm. It's pretty obvious there's no way up, so... Now the only real question is, how am I going to get back? That's the real multi-million dollar question, and the answer is actually quite simple. Certainly not that way. A sec. If I do that when I can do this. There we go. a little high. has to be a way out of here. So this will be the point of me, uh... Oh, wait a minute. Wait a second. I'm an idiot. I was actually closer the first time around. I just can't believe I realized that until now. push it forward. Doesn't really matter. My main question is, why can't she only do part of the way when we all know that she's fully capable of pushing that block all the way without uh, having to stop? There we go.
Oh, she does it automatically. All right, never mind. Never mind. Goodness, I, uh... Well, thank goodness that uh, I found that secret. And thank, even more thankful I got that key and that idol. So, this could come in handy. No, they are gonna come in handy. One way or another. snakes in it. All right, let's get let's get you back to fresh airville. here. Ooh, cache of items of sorts. So what's this that we just picked up? Magnum. Probably do more damage is my guess. And more medkits too. Very, very nice. Okay, so that's one problem solved. I don't think there's anything else in here, so back we go. be away at oh there's another switch hello ah, just up above very nice Oof. and even more items nice takes us back to here again. I 
can't ever see the camera when it's snapped back. But anyways, oh, with some more mystery solved, I'm wondering where to go next. I'll just have to go back underwater one more time. Really shouldn't come as a surprise if that was the case. Unless I have to go back to the beginning. Which, once again, wouldn't surprise me. No. Oh, here we go. Get off of me, you little, little turd. Although the sad thing is that Lara's killing off one of nature's pollinators. Because without bats, they wouldn't be able to pollinate any flowers, and chances are we would end up all going hungry. Jesus. God, like I said, the combat is extremely finicky. something they should have worked on. Make the combat mechanics and movement mechanics much simpler. Oh my god, that's just so... It's just so flimsy.
All because the camera's so flimsy. And I really wish that the camera would not snap when it resets itself. Oh, come on. You couldn't grab that? Seriously? You couldn't have grabbed that? Good lord, Lara. You control horribly. And like I said, the tank controls are better than the modern controls, but... There you go. Okay, now that was just a bad move on my part. <sighs> Jesus, Lara, stop running so horribly. Just walk up the stairs. Not that hard. Yeah, like I said, I gotta stop doing that. I hit jump and then and then I held the action button. That should have launched her forward. I don't know why it didn't. Okay, you ran forward and yet you still turned right. I don't get that. Boy, Lara, you can be incredibly stupid at times. Maybe I should try with a PlayStation controller next time instead of an Xbox controller. See if that makes a difference. What the heck? Are you really just this dumb Lara? Seriously, like, what the heck? Boy. Okay, I just tapped forward and you just launched yourself forward. Boy, you really are stupid. God. Like I said, the controls are really horrible in this game, and I thought Resident Evil controls were terrible. Oh my god. I can't believe you just did that. I can't believe you just did that. Really, just this dumb? Wow. Wow. I'm just burning a lot of time doing the exact same things again and again, which I have no patience for. No, I also have less time for stupidity. People are gonna, you don't think I'm stupid in my presence? Do it when I'm not here. Oh, no, oh, now you decided to just jump up there whenever you freaking feel like it. Okay, and you just did it again. Wow. You, I held down the jump button, and you just decided not to respond. Or maybe I just need tinier hands. I don't know. You're asking me? Oh my god, I held the run I held the jump button and it did absolutely nothing. In fact, I can actually prove it too. In fact, I am gonna prove it. Now watch closely. Let's get you into position. Hey, see? 
See? Pro point proven. The controls are something they should have first worked on. Well, cameras too. I wish you really would stop base, base planting the wall. No, Laura, turn around. Turn the heck around. There you go. See? That wasn't so hard. Now, was it? Boy, boy, it's just a lot just to do one thing. That's really, really sad. I heard bats. Never mind. Nothing there. No, 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 no. We're not going through that again. Uh uh. Hopefully in the other two games, the controls have improved. I hope. Okay, so it's the door on the right. And some shotgun shells. Alright, so we're going to get a shotgun at some point. Not anytime soon. Oh, oh, oh. Gimme, 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 gimme. Gimme. Perfect. You can never have too many med kits. And of course the door shuts. Why am I not surprised? I gotta go through all that malarkey again. <sighs> Great. Not my fault the controls suck. The game's fault for not being obedient the first time around like I asked it to. But, like I said, at least I now know what to do. So that's the important thing. See that? Should have been done the first time. Yeah, I know I sound a bit nitpicky, but sometimes in this day and age you gotta be a little nitpicky. There we go. Much better. Good job, Lara. Good job. You get a cookie. Actually, you don't get squat. Uh, okay, I'll take that. Sure. Uh, okay, I'll take that. Not exactly what I wanted, but it's gonna have to do. You really are stupid. There you go. Okay, and I didn't even tell you to go in the water either. Get back, get out of there right now. No, get out of the water. I can't believe you did that, you idiot. God. 
And with the platforms gone, I can't progress any farther. Nice job, Lara. You mucked it up. God, you should you should have been up there the first time around. No. No except no excuses. Now how are you gonna get up there? And I don't believe the platforms were set, so. Oh my lord. Oh my sweet gentle Jesus. I can't exit because the door will shut enough to go through all that again. Oh my god. Wow. That is lunacy, and then that is you, Lara. And I have virtually no other tools that'll get me up there. None. Whatsoever. Oh my god. Oh my aching skull. And you can't try again either. This is a one-shot deal. I'm gonna have to restart the level. Yeah, I'm gonna have to, because I can't get back up there. Yeah. And you can't shimmy across, either. Oh, my lord. My lord, after all that... I don't have time to answer that now. I don't have time to answer phone calls right now. I'm in the middle of something far more important. But, anyways. Anyways, I'm trying to figure out exactly where to go next. Well, you know what? This is an opportune time to uh, practice. Unless the platforms do regenerate, and I'm not aware of it. Never mind. Like I said, this is a good opportunity to practice, uh... Wow. Perfect. I wish you wouldn't face plant yourself. She is. Don't want to bust up that pretty face. Just in case I missed. Laura, stop it. And I really wish those weren't, uh, breakable platforms. goes to prove that I have to go through all this again just to get back to where I once was. 
Because these stupid platforms do not regenerate. I mean, yeah, I know this is not Mario 64, but still, they should be get they really unfair that they don't give the player a second chance. That's really not fair. Oh. Oh, never mind. Huh. Now, if only Lara would actually grab onto the platform like she's supposed to, then I wouldn't be complaining so much. Huh. Uh, the things I do for love. There you go. See, Lara? That wasn't so hard. Hmm. Whew. That was actually pretty sweet. Oh my god. You couldn't jump up to reach that? How stupid are you? Come on. It was right above you. You could not have been this stupid. Jesus Christ. Even a five-year-old knows they can get up there. Wow. <sighs> oh, Jesus Christ, Laura. Come on. You were able to get up there once. Oh, brother. Like I said, the things I do for love. And just to get things done. Like I said, the controls are extremely flimsy. There you go. Okay, you just did it again. Oh my god. Ah. <sighs> I mean, I am getting used to this, but that's not the point. The point is, is that I don't want to spend all day doing just one thing. There you go. See that? You could have easily made it up there. I don't know what the I don't know what the stinking problem is. Unless I'm not supposed to go up that way. That's all I can think of. Okay, why are your controls so delayed? I mean, you had no trouble getting up there before. I mean, come on. Like I said before, a five-year-old could easily get up there. I don't know what a great explorer like you is having so many issues with. I said the control should have been the first thing they should have worked on. Oh my freaking god. The only thing I'm thinking of is maybe because. Okay, get... Get up there.
Unless I'm not supposed to go that way. I mean, it's just the common sense route is all. Okay, so that answered... Now I see the puzzle a little bit more clearly now. I was not... I'm not supposed to go up there. I gotta go this way. Can't believe it took me that long to figure out. But then again, can you blame me? What did I just get done saying just a few moments ago? A five-year-old could have figured this out. But... But the good news is we are making progress, so... And I kind of wish Laura wouldn't take such big strides either. What did I just get done saying? Oh, my lord. And like I said, I have the basics down, but my god, do they need work. Okay, now do that again up there. Like, seriously, just do it. Nope. Oh, God. I really need a stiff drink after this, and I don't drink alcohol, so... Love you, Lara, but even I admit you're starting to get on my nerves. What did I just get done saying? You could have easily made that jump. I don't know what the problem is. Why, just because you need a little momentum to start? I'm sorry you're not Mario. At least I'm getting the jumping down, so that's actually a good omen. Unless maybe that is too far. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't hecking know. There you go. See? Not too tough. Now, was it? Whoa. Whew. Ugh. Ugh. That, that's a, that's a sight right there. Seeing inside Lara's head. Ugh. Oh my god. Like I said, the instant... Yeah, you see, the jump is extremely delayed. That's something that should have been fixed. As soon as you... Yeah. I know... I know the emphasis was trying to get on realism here, but that really doesn't account for the fact that that's not an excuse to delay jump mechanics. It just feels so delayed. And yes, I know this is a 1996 classic, but still. Wait, unless I was supposed So I wonder how you're gonna get across that. I'm gonna go get myself a piece of a humble pie. Because that was unexpected. I did not expect that. Not in the least. You idiot. Wow. Oh, boy. But, 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 to be fair, I know what to do now. And like I said, it's always these first part streams that are always going to be the most frustrating, but once we get into later streams, however, then it should not be a, too much of a problem. It's always the first parts that get you. God, you had that lined up so perfectly, and yet you missed. 
I'm probably sure I'm not the only one who suffered through this. I'm not the only one. And of course, this also this also doesn't uh, exactly answer my other question. How was I able to make a jump from such a when the object was directly above me? No problem, but there's a huge there's a bit of a space right there, and yet Laura can't jump that. What kind of sense does that make? The answer, none. It makes absolutely no sense here, whatsoever. Oh no, wait, I was supposed to do this. Never mind. What? Hey, wait a second. I wonder if I can backflip up there. That would be that. That is a food for thought. And like I said before, I'm not the only one who had to suffer through this. Or had issues with this when they first played. I'm not the only one. Hmm. I swear, if I can actually backflip up there, I am still going to eat a piece of humble pie. Okay, I didn't tell you to run, you idiot. You were supposed to walk. Yep, shimming helps. Okay, I will accept that. Hmm. Okay, so maybe not. I mean, it was a good effort, it was a good idea, but it didn't work in the execution department. That would have been pretty cool. Oh my god. Plus, isn't there a way to, like, actually avoid ball damage in this game? I could have heard, I could have sworn there is. Hmm. Yeah, like I said, these controls are so imprecise. I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, once you get used to them, it's not so bad. No, what are you doing? What are you doing, Lara? There you go. There you go. See? Not too difficult. Not too hard. Now, was it? Oh, you know what? This, this, this could work. This could work. No! Oh my, oh my sweet gentle Jesus, I can't believe you did that. I cannot believe you did that. Wow, now we gotta go through all this malarkey again. Oh my god. These controls are the controls are extremely delayed. Well the jump the jumping is delayed. Movements movements so so. 
I think they focused a little too much on realism and not enough on actual functionality. And I can easily go back to Super Mario 64 to prove my point, too. Because the controls in Super Mario 64 game are far more intuitive compared to this. go about freaking time get off of me stupid bat and like I said I could not have been the only one who has suffered with these controls I could not have been the only one Okay, so now the middle door's got to be open. Yeah, the middle door's now officially open. Time to get going. I don't think there's anything here, so... Oh, nice job. Now I gotta go through all this again. Great. Oh my god. Wow, just because of something stupid. But, to be fair, I now know what to do. And after all that, I cannot believe I died. That is so... That's just really unfair, just because Laura can fall from such... That was about a medium height, and managed to get herself killed. Logic problems? Yes. I can understand taking a lot of damage, but death? No. And there's no and there's no save point either, so which means you have to complete this in one fell swoop. Another thing that should have been fixed. Oh, and I actually got that on my first try, so nice job, me. So way to go, me. There you go. All right. Alright, so the next time around, things are going to be a little bit smoother. That's better for my sake. Because like I said, now I know what to do. By the way, that drowning death was my fault. I will give it that. I should give it one more. There we go. All right, let's go grab the idol and the key and let's get out of here, eh? And you get out of my face, you stupid bat.
Okay, stop doing that, Lara. You're not supposed to do that unless I say so. Okay, now get up there. Don't, don't, no, Lara, don't be stupid now. Come on. We're not going through this again. There you go. Okay, that takes care of that. And like I said, the biggest problem with this game is that there's no between stage feature. Or in stage feature, rather. You have to do this in one fell swoop, which makes absolutely zero sense. I'm gonna burn a large, uh... I'll just burn a large med kit, because I, I can always get more. Alright, so like I said before, now I know what to do. So now, hopefully this shouldn't take me too long to get back. That's in the room of the snakes, but I gotta get oxygen first. Then we gotta come back. Alright, time to dive. Like I said, at least the swimming is very easy. I really wish you would stop face planning, Lara. Like, for real. As long as I have the gold idol and the silk and the skull key, I can move on to other pl other places. Which reminds me, here I gotta go back. I gotta re I gotta open that door. Right, that's the there's the switch. 
I don't believe there's anything else down here, so... Alright, got myself a little more oxygen. Okay, yeah, I don't think there really is anything else down here, so... We can move on. That's perfect. Ah, it feels good to be back. Now I can go through that skull door and get out of here once more. Already, never mind. Like I said before, now I know what to do in a room like this. I like these, rather. Okay, that was just a little too much momentum. Not so difficult, now was it? No, it wasn't. Strange. That didn't seem to be too problematic that time. Very strange. Alright, 
So we're back to this room once again. And I really won't need to rely on the, uh, on the crumbling tiles this time. I don't need to rely on them. Because I now know what to do. Look how much... Now, like I said before, now this is going much more smoothly. I like that. Ooh. You know what? I'll take it. I will take it. Ah, oh, Jesus, no. No. This is a game that Night Dive should have made instead of a Aspire. They would have turned this game into gold for sure. Alright, now that is progress. Oof. Dang it, again? Oh my freaking god. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding. You have got to be kidding me. You just did it again. Oh my god, after all that. And, and you know what's funny? I actually held the action button and she should actually should just glide it down. I don't know why she jumped. This game really should have been in Night Dive's hands, not Aspire's. And like I said, the controls should have been the very first thing they should have worked on. No exceptions. Like I said before, Night Dive could easily made this game into gold.
Alright, I'm giving this thing one more try. Otherwise, I'm going to have to do this off camera because I am sick of this level already. Get off of me, you little... Okay, now I gotta go back underwater once more.
The only thing I'm grateful for is that I'm glad they didn't remake a Tomb Raider Angel of Darkness. Ugh. That would just be bad in its own right. Nice. So we're back to this once again. Back here once again to the that explains why I died because concerned Lara Croft doesn't understand how to grapple onto things. Perfect. Like I said, now I know, now I understand how things work. You know, now that I think about it.
Oh, okay, so there actually is a safe spot here. All right, never mind. But on second thought here, now that I think about it, I'm gonna change it back to tank control. Switch it back to tank. Yeah, that's better. See how much nicer that is? That is so much nicer. Got it. All right, that first part wasn't too bad. All right, yeah, the first part's not that bad. This part can be a bit of a challenge. It's a little more time consuming, if you will. No. Well, okay. Okay, I will accept it this one time only. Alright, that's much, much better. Oh yeah, that's right, I forgot. I am supposed to do this. There you go, we did it on the first try, yay! This might work. Oh yeah, piece of cake. Oh yeah, that's much better. Much, much, much better. God bless him, you know what? Oh, that is so much better. die oh my god oh my sweet gentle jesus you know i actually had the first aid kit selected but no or rather gone to the first aid where the first aid kit is oh, and i gotta do this all over again god what is the problem here Yeah, like seriously, what is the freaking problem? Ah, <sighs> my sweet gentle Jesus. I could have been at least another two levels ahead already if it wasn't for this malarkey, but no. This combat is so awful. 
Because like I previously said, it does not focus on... Yeah, it doesn't focus on the target. It just... It hit the target one, and as soon as the target's out of range, it doesn't stay locked on. Oh, well, whatever. Like I said, now I know what to do. I'm making progress, so... Counts for something, I guess. <sighs> so annoying. I gotta go run all the way back, get the key, get the idol, come back, do this whole gosh darn water thing again. Now, this is just so not worth it. What are you doing? You really are stupid. God. Just flip the switch once. You don't need to do it 50 times. Get off of me, you little, little turd. Oh, that's right. Okay, so she can't climb and shoot at the same time. That would be an impressive feat, but even I admit that wouldn't be worth it. Okay, let's get back to this mess. Oh, other way. Oh, so I gotta do some swimming. Give Lara a case of swimmer's ear. Okay, stop doing your acrobats, all right? Get in the water.
bad wolf. The only other thing I can think of is after the second part of the uh, climb, I should just head back down the same way I came. That would have been a that would save a lot of headaches. Too bad I didn't have to think of that. There we go. we go. Alright, now this is going a lot more smoothly. Well, I better not say that because I'll end up jinxing myself if I did. supposed to do this. Nice. 
nicely done. Like I said, very nicely done. Instead of going, instead of taking this way, leading me to a certain death, I'm gonna go back this way. I'm gonna take a longer route out. Oh yeah, that's so much better. That's vastly better. Yeah, well, Mr. Bear, guess what? You're up there, I'm over here. So, meh. As long as there isn't any more malarkey here, I should be just fine. bear doing hanging out in there that's that's the real question what is he doing just hanging out in there like that is he there just for show I mean I don't know You're asking the wrong person the wrong thing Oh yeah, there's also this too. Oh, thank God I'm out of there. Whew. Hey, two or three secrets, not bad. That's about all the deaths I had to take just to get here. Oh. But, I uh, gotta give myself credit here. At least... Alright. Oh. I think that is good. Oh, I think on that note here, uh, we did all right for ourselves. Could have, I wish I could have gone at least one more level had I not died so many times. But before I end the stream here, I'm going to head back to Lara's house and see if I missed anything. I'll take you on a guided tour. Use the D-pad to go into the music room. I felt like there's something missing. I feel like I feel like you either play the piano or play the harp. No? Alright, how about the harp? Can I play you? Ah. Oh, the 
Train Hall. Sorry about the crates. I'm having some things put into storage and the delivery people haven't been yet. Yeah, like I said, I feel like there's something missing here. Outside a bunch of face plants. Like I said, I feel like there's something missing that should have been done. That's how it's supposed to have been done. Number five, I'm not going to deal with here because I think I know how to do number five. Let's go for a swim. The jump button and the directions move me around underwater. Okay, so I guess there really isn't anything else here. Um, I think on that note here, um, thank you to those who watch. I'll see you all next time.